This is the second method for the same question, right? This is the second method. So we are going to use this same formula that we used in the previous method. Just we are going to do it directly, not take the longer steps, right? So we have this formula, V is equal to W by Q, right? We need to find out the work done and work done can be found out, find out, uh, can be, you know, find using this formula, right? So we have to find the work done on this negative 4.5 times 10 to the power minus 9, NO is minus 10 to the power minus 9, right? Okay, so we know that we don't have this value, right? electric potential right so we're gonna find this electric potential using this formula right okay and you might be asking why I use this formula because this formula is basically used to find the electric you know electric potential due to a point charge the 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 this point charge you know this uh, the value was basically 7 times 10 to power minus 9 the electric potential made by this basically point charge right so I'm going to just make them equal, right? So it's W by Q equals to Q by uh, Q basically uh, times K by R, right? And then W is equal to Q1. Th basically, remember that this is Q1 charge for this one and Q2 charge for basically this one, right? So Q1 times Q2 times K by R, right? So now we're going to substitute the value and we're going to find for both for the 4 centimeter and the for the 9 centimeter the work done that was been done and then we're going to basically subtract them and then we're going to get our total work done right. So for the first one which is 4 centimeter Q1 is minus 4.5 times 10 to power minus 9 right and then we have 7 times 10 to power minus 9 right as well. Now we the k value which is you know the 1 by 4 pi uh, per times per meter of space right so basically that value has been given at the end of your exam paper right so this value of k is basically 8.99 times 10 raised to power 9 right so you're going to divide it by 4 centimeter right 4 centimeter which will give you the value of negative 7.79 times 10 to power minus 6 right and then you can put dots you know because we need the recurring value as well to get the more accurate value right so now we are basically going to use for the 4 centimeter make sure to divide by 100 right i just wrote 4 centimeter you know i later divided my calculator into meter make sure to divide by 100 right as well so w is equal to so the same thing Four minus four point five seven and an eight point nine, right? Minus four point five times ten to power minus nine times seven times ten to power minus nine, right? And then we basically have times eight point nine nine times ten to power nine by basically the four centimeter. We have the other one is nine centimeter, and make sure to divide by meters, right? So you get your value as negative, basically negative 3.1465 times 10 raised to power minus 6 joules right okay now we have to take the difference of the work done and that work done is basically the work done done when the, this charge was moved from 4 centimeter to 9 centimeter right so the total charge is basically equal to total work done sorry total work done is basically equal to these two subtracted right so 9 basically 9 centimeter 9 centimeter value right is subtracted from basically the 7 uh, the 4 centimeter value right so you get your answer and dot dot right and you get your answer as basically 3.9 times 3.9 3 3 and then you get 1 2 5 times 10 to power basically my bad 10 to power basically minus 6 right so I can see that in the question they have basically given in one decimal place so I can write it as 3.9 times 10 raised to power minus 6 joules right so work done unit is joules right remember that so this is your final answer